We're here at the Royal Swedish Academy of Sciences, which has decided the Nobel Prize in Chemistry ever since 1901. Uh, this is the room where all the journalists are gathered ahead of the announcement. The Nobel Committee will come through this door very shortly. Now, we all like to predict who might win this prize, but the secrecy around the decision is so great that we're very rarely right. The prize, when it was announced, was for the development of metal organic frameworks. The Royal Swedish Academy of Sciences has today decided to award the 2025 Nobel Prize in Chemistry to... Three winners. Japan, Australia, USA. USA again. Susuma Kitagawa, Richard Robson and Jordanian-American Omar M. Yagi's work means we could be able to harvest water from desert air and remove CO2 from the atmosphere. Carbon capture is one of the potential uses. There's been some controversy whether this is a sort of greenwashing technology that can't really be effective. It can be, but it's not clear yet if this will be commercially successful. Uh, we need to develop better methods. Different methods have also been suggested for the selection of laureates. Well, the new Nobel laureates didn't walk out of this room with their prizes. They were never here. They're informed by telephone just before the rest of the world is told. But the announcement made here does enrich them by more than $1 million. Hopefully their work has some benefit for the rest of us as well. Paul Rees, Al Jazeera, Stockholm. Don't miss out. Get the full picture. Subscribe to Al Jazeera for reliable news, expert insight. Like, share, stay ahead.